cool. I love this place. What's this? Treasure map or something? Now that's booty. Yeah. Alright. Reward. The plan for gray sails. Don't really need that, but it'd be cool to find the treasure. Oh, that's cool. They included a way to get back. Oh, I love the designers at Ubisoft. Yeah, what else? Uh, do I have a map yet? No, I don't. I need to find this point. Uh, can I set marker? Is that it? That's it. Enter. All right. 153. This was AC Brotherhood. I would be saying, "I'll see you guys when I get there." But this is Assassin's Creed 4, where your running rate is rapidly increased, and I can just say, "I'm gonna run all the way there without a problem," because yeah. Of course, shadow and lighting effects kind of killing my frame rate. Oh wow, 14, 15. Ooh. What's this upgrade? I don't have enough reals to buy it, but I wonder what it is. Looks like a map or some sort of chest. I need to sink this point though, so I can figure out where doorways are. That would be kind of helpful. What the heck? Why don't I just jump over? Eh. Oh well. And if you guys haven't already seen it, go out. Seen it? Go out and check my um, Assassin's not Assassin's Creed. My Battlefield 4 Commander Mode series. It's um, I can pump those out rather quickly, so it's almost almost gonna be a daily upload sort of thing. It might be every like double days, a break, and then two days. That's actually a pretty good recording plan. So yeah, something like that probably. But yeah, I talk about not only showing you guys commander mode and some stuff you can do and some pretty sweet missile launches from the cruise missiles and deploy gunship kills and a whole bunch of other stuff. Uh, I talk about some stuff that I found find interesting on the internet. So, yeah. Go check that out. It w goes live 7 o'clock. At least my first episode of it does. 7 o'clock on the 23rd, which is a Thursday. Which is when I'm recording this, but you guys might be seeing this a little later. Then Thursday, that is. What else can we quickly check out here? A whole bunch of chest stuff. And I haven't showed you guys running around places yet, and I thought it would be a good idea to show you guys where everything is here, because it's, as I said before, a big part of the Assassin's Creed 4 universe. It doesn't look like it on my record, on um, what I'm looking at right now, but the recording is going to look amazing, especially with all these shadows effects. I love God Ray lighting. Ah. And who else saw the video of the sun dog over Russia? That was cool. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, YouTube it, or if you want to me to explain it, it's essentially where there's the sun and the atmosphere aligned on a perfect angle, sort of, and they create this halo around the sun, creating two separate suns. And I think that's kind of cool. It's a nice little atmospheric effect. Uh, renovate the manor's facade. All right. Well, sounds interesting. Have to get more reals though. Hey, wake up, you! My other laps, my laptop's going to sleep. Although they were doing the Pokemon thing in there, and I don't like the Pokemon thing. And the Pokemon thing is when you um, at least I call it the Pokemon thing. It's when you uh, lose the ability to sprint incredibly fast inside of buildings. And now Assassin's Creed has been known to do this before, including screwing with my camera angle, which I hate. Uh, I understand the necessity for it, because they want to show off what's inside of the buildings. You know, that that's the point of it, but I don't like it. All that much. Oh! Nerdgasm! This is so cool! It may not seem that new, but this is incredible. What happens if I do this? Oh, it pushes me. Okay, that's a little bit th while ago. Is there a point where I can fall down? Oh, uh, yeah, there is. Okay. 
sorry, there's the fact that they would include something like that on a water wheel effect. I think it's a, I think it's amazing. Wow, I can't believe they would actually do that. And the water, that water dough. Oh, and while I have you guys' attention from my slight, well, not slight, my incredible <laughs> nerdgasm there, the um, Assassin's Creed Liberation was released on the 15th. A couple days, well, almost a week ago now. More than a week ago, in fact. And it was greeted with bad reviews. Essentially, what it amounted to was a rehash and a combination of Assassin's Creed 3 and Assassin's Creed 4. And keep in mind, I do not have first-hand experience, as I did not pre-order it. Um, so I don't have it currently. Where's that cave entrance? There's a... Yeah, here it is. Um... I didn't pre-order it, so I don't... I haven't played it myself, but I've seen some gameplay videos online, and... Uh... Honestly, they could do better. I mean, it was a pretty good idea. You know, I like the addition of the, uh, addition of the Persona system. And that's essentially where you've got different... If you change an outfit, you change your notoriety level for that outfit, and notoriety level saves for that outfit. Except I will agree with Total Biscuit on one fact that the lady persona, how you lose notoriety, is by killing eyewitnesses. And I, this is something I've had a problem with um, with since the Assassin's Creed series, since I started playing it. It was that... Can I not climb this? Okay, good. Because <laughs> I think if they did that to try and block up this area, I think that would be kind of stupid. But... Notori to lose notoriety, you have to kill eyewitnesses. So, to let me explain this. Let me break this down. Please insert disc. Oh, shit. Um, hold on. Yeah, I just had to reboot the recording because my backup program decided to interrupt me in the middle of recording, and I really need to delete it because it's annoying as hell. And it ha it's, it's almost like a worm. It will find its way throughout my... Um, my files and just create copies of itself. It, but it, it's actually a pretty good backup software. It just it works. It, it works, but it's kind of bad. I don't know. I'm not explaining this very well. I've gone backwards. <laughs> right. I should have clued in when I saw the branch. Oh well. I don't like the fact that you zoom in. That's kind of annoying. Like you zoom in when you go through it. Which way do I go? I think this way. Over here? Yeah, this is when I did the kid chase. That sounds bad. When I did the James kid chase. <laughs> James the kid. Yeah. Totally not chasing kids. It's a music thing up here. Oh, there it is. Now be cautious when you approach these, because they have two different directions that they will escape to. One, they will run in the direction opposite you, or they will run towards you. It's only it's only a weird glitch if they run towards you. So you... As soon as I get up here, it's going to start moving. Oh, that one was an easy one. Probably because you're supposed to encounter it near closer into the game, so you didn't have to do mu that much jumping for it. Because the ones I've done recently are just, like, frickin' elusive, man. You could chase that thing for an hour. You wouldn't even find it. It's ridiculous. Uh, maybe I'll go grab that chest first. Did my waypoint disappear? Oh, I did. That's... Can I not grab that chest from up here? Oh, no, yeah, here you go. Whoa. Cool. A bunch of mine ruins. Why didn't I just jump? The health regeneration is ridiculously fast. What else I got? I got two things over here. And I actually talked about this in a commander mode episode. I guess I've got three recorded. I just haven't got them rendered yet. 
But anyway, in the Commander episode, I talked about Titanfall. And Titanfall actually has... It had... Somebody leaked some... Like, I think it was 10 minutes of alpha footage. And it looks cool. <laughs> like... It, it's it's looking a l honestly in my opinion on it right now from just looking at the alpha it looks a little call of duty ish i mean yeah the verticality i love the verticality and the fact that there's titans but i do not like the fact that the maps are kind of small because i uh, maybe i'm just biased because of battlefield because the maps are just freaking huge but i'm not really too sure i just i like it I would like it if they made the maps a little bit more interesting, or a little bit bigger. Yeah. Oh, hold on, guys. Unfortunately, this is me, guys. My computer just did a little... weird thing that I'm slightly concerned about, and I will have to cut this recording session here. So, I would like to thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like, favorite, subscribe, and all of that good stuff, and I will see you guys next time. This is the Hexagon Zero, signing out.